Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, Microsoft Edge has received an update, which rolled out late on Friday, the 23rd of May, in my part of the world. And just to double check, we have the update. We head to our main menu, help and feedback about Microsoft Edge. And I'm sure that if you were using Edge over the weekend, you would have received the update already. Now, once the update has been applied, version and build is sitting on 136.0.3240.92. And this is a non-security bug fix update that includes one announcement by Microsoft and three bug fixes. Now, just on a side note, last week as I posted, Google rolled out Chrome version 137, which was the early stable, but they pushed 137 out to everybody. I'll leave that video linked down below and in the end screen, which was a week early. And although that's the case, I still see that Microsoft Edge and the other Chromium-based web browsers are not updating yet. They are still sitting on version 136. And according to their release notes for Microsoft Edge and Brave as an example, if we just head to the calendar, we should start seeing Brave roll out tomorrow that'll be late tomorrow in my region and microsoft edge starting thursday that will be late on thursday in my region so that's more or less what we're looking at but we can expect those 137 upgrades for brave and edge to start rolling out later this week chrome has already moved up last week now getting back to this point release for edge now the announcement according to microsoft they say that starting this month Microsoft Edge will show more productivity-related Copilot prompts near the search box on the new tab page. So this is more Copilot and AI coming into the browser. Over and above that, Microsoft says there will also be a new Copilot button that will send your current search query to Copilot. Now, don't get that confused with the Copilot a button and toggle that's already available in Microsoft Edge, which takes you to Copilot. This is something else Microsoft is talking about. And Microsoft says these updates are available across all Microsoft Edge channels and are rolling out gradually to all users. So I'm not seeing it yet. So you may or may not have seen it yet. Just bringing it to your attention. That's an announcement by Microsoft. More AR coming into the browser. Now focusing on the three bug fixes Microsoft says they fixed an issue that may have affected extensions that bring up a window. Now, the problem was extensions designed to run continuously were being paused in the background when the window was minimized or occluded, according to Microsoft. So that's been fixed. Second bug fix, Microsoft says it's fixed an issue that caused the Microsoft Defender Application Guard window to automatically close one minute after launch without any user interaction. And then the third bug fix is they fixed an issue that prevented text from being displayed and other rendering issues when viewing certain PDF files containing Japanese fonts. I think that's more region specific. So there we have it. That's our latest point release that Microsoft has pushed out. Non-security update. And I have had a quick look like I always do around the browser after any update is being applied. And I'm not noticing any tweaks or adjustments when it comes to front-facing features. And obviously, when version 137 rolls out later this week, I'll post and let you guys know. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.